So for today's comparison, we have the Motorola G32 versus the Poco M4 Pro. Now let's begin. So for screen type, AMOLED display a lot better than the IPS, even though the AMOLED might tend to burn out a bit faster. Refresh rate, they are both 90 Hz, except for the Poco M4, it's a lot brighter. And pixel density, the Poco M4 is a slightly bit lighter at 409. And resolution, they are both using a Full HD. We have an AMOLED display, the Poco will be spot on. Screen size, they are both the same, 6.5. Don't say 6.43 because you won't know the difference. Protection is better in the POCO M4. AMOLED display, the POCO M4 has a clearly better screen of a performance. So for the processor, it might be slim slower, 2.05, but the multiple core will perform faster than the 2.4. Chipset Snapdragon 860, as I said, the Helio G96 is a lot faster due to the core. GPU, the Mali G57 again, chipset superb quality matching with the amoled display screen system they are both 4g out of the box android 12 in the motorola and battery they are both 5000 milliamp they'll last the same similar timing and fast charging 33 watts faster not by a lot though maybe one minute faster within full charge but the better performance go to the poco m4 now for the camera so the Poco M4 is coming to a better 64 megapixel main lens. It's 50 megapixels in the motor roller, not bad. They are both using the 8 megapixel ultra wide lens and macro lens. They are the same, 2 megapixel. You get better camera quality out of the Poco M4 for real. Main video recording, they are both fully HD up to 30 frames per second. And selfie camera, both of them 16 megapixel. The aperture are the same 2.4, but they're not good quality in low light. And front video recording, only fully HD, 30 frames per second. You won't really need any more than that, though, but the better camera go to the Poco M4. Now for the storage. So memory card, yes, they are both supported in both devices, up to one terabyte. And UFS, confirm 2.2 in the Poco. It should be 2.2 in the Motorola, but you know Motorola. RAM, better 8 gig in the Poco, while it's 6 gig in the Motorola. Storage, again, better in the Poco M4, up to 256. 128, that's a bit small. Better storage again, go to the Poco M4. For the design, uh, the weight difference, 179 gram, 184 gram, that's heavy. Water resistance, only splash proof in the Motorola, so don't get it in water. While the Poco IP53, so it's slightly bit better. Not by a lot though. Earphone, yes, available in both devices. Radio, yes, available also. So the Poco, again, as I said, has a way better screen. Looking good with the Poco. NFC, yes, available in both devices. And the fingerprints are located on the side of both of the device. One thing with this side sensor, you tend to be touching it a lot. Bluetooth faster than the Motorola 5.2. The better design and more durable have to be the Poco M4. The pricing again, they will be similar, same pricing kind of a bit. But there's no surprise there, the Poco M4 clearly better. It has a better screen, better performance, the camera is slightly bit better, storage better, and it has a way better design. Comment below which do you want me to do next. See you in the next video, guys.